Hello everyone, in this quick video, I'm going to list all of the major F-16 mods that I know of. If you've been coming to this channel for a while, then you've already seen me cover the SUFA mod from IDF Project. We're going to keep the ball rolling here and briefly cover the latest updates, 3.8 and the most recent drop, 3.9. Also, we're going to take a look at TechSax F-16 Viper Textures Overhaul Mod and the Moroccan F-16. Let's get right into it. First up, I'll show some footage from the SUFA 3.8, which includes the new pilot body model. Unfortunately, version 3.9 removes the new pilot body model due to some issues with shadows, which is a real bummer. Hopefully we'll see the new pilot body return in a future release. Besides that, the version 3.9 fixes some conflicts with DCS Open Beta and Pacific. It fixes the GPU 3.9 with multiplayer servers. So for sure, you'll want to upgrade to the latest version. I'm just going to scroll the patch notes here, but I'd encourage everyone to hop onto the IDF Mod Project Discord so that you can engage with the community, give the developers feedback, and stay on top of the latest patch yourself. Next, let's check out TechSax F16 Texture Overhaul, in which I personally think should replace the default F16 texture that Ed made. Granted, I haven't checked the file sizes. Maybe Ed's version has a smaller footprint. Next, check out this footage where we zoom in close to look at Ed's F16 default texture. I'm just gonna let this footage play for like 10 seconds and just give the viewer the chance to come to their own conclusion and then we're gonna, I'm gonna briefly cover the changes that was made, but it was a lot. So I'm just gonna give a quick summary, I suppose. Alright, what does everyone think? I think the differences are massive. I hope to see texture artists adopt this new template and produce even higher quality textures for the F-16. Let's go. Okay folks, this is the Moroccan F-16 skin, which also supports the CFT mod. Note, the CFT mod has no relation to the IDF Mod Projects SUFA Mod. I personally use the mod manager called OVGME, which I cover in a previous video that I'll hopefully remember to insert a link to at the top right corner of this video. Using the mod manager, I can quickly swap between the mods when DCS is closed. This skin looks absolutely fantastic in my opinion. Check the video description for the download link. Also, recall this texture also works without the CFT mod if you do not want to install that. Alright, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.